There are many industries that use Adobe Illustrator to create content for a variety of different purposes. Websites, packaging designs, logos, graphic design, you name it. One of the missing elements in Illustrator has always been the difficulty required to gather all of the components that were used in a project, such as fonts and graphics. Well, in the latest Creative Cloud update from Adobe, wait no longer. Finally, we have the ability to easily package all of the components of a project to send to other users. Let's see how this works. I'm beginning this video with the package.ai file already open on my computer. And this is really a mock-up of a web page, and we've got some placed images that are used in this project. If we go to our window menu and go to links, we can see that all of these images are placed files. Now, the thing is, we can utilize this feature for a number of different purposes. One of the most obvious reasons to do this is for print production. Now, even though these are fairly low-res images, the production department still needs these images in case they need to make any changes or maybe even swap out another image. So, to include all of these components, including the fonts that I used, I'm going to go to the File menu and I'm going to choose Package. Now, this is a pretty basic package dialog box, and what it's telling me is where it's going to save my package folder. So, the location is currently being defined right up here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on this folder, and I'm just going to go to my desktop, and I'm going to save it to my desktop. For the folder name, you can really call it whatever you want. I'm going to call this Bikes United Site. And in the options here, we want to make sure that we copy all of the links used in this project. We're going to collect those links in a totally separate folder, which is what we want. And we also want to relink the linked files to this document that we're copying, because we want it to point to the correct location. In addition, we wanted to copy all the fonts used in the document, except CGK stands for Chinese, Japanese, and Korean. It's unable to copy those types of fonts. And finally, we're going to let the package command create a report for us. So I'm going to click the package button, and it's giving me a dialog regarding the licensing issues for our fonts. So you want to read that, and then we'll go ahead and click OK. It'll give you a final dialog indicating that the package was created successfully. And a nice little feature is that you can click the Show Package button to show the package folder in the Finder or the Windows Explorer. Now you'll notice, here's my folder, and I have a Fonts folder, I have a Links folder, and I have the actual Illustrator file that I copied. We also have a package report. You can open that up and just read that. That just gives us details regarding what was done or what was included in the package. And then you can zip this folder up and you can send it off to whoever needs it next. As you can see, this feature is a must for many Illustrator users who need to send their projects off to another department or another company. As you can see, this feature is a must for many Illustrator users who need to send their projects off to another department or another company. The package command does this exactly the way you would expect it, elegantly.